Attention! Dog shit! Yes! Gulliver Burns, Gulliver Cars. This is the Jeep Commander. Come check it out. Now, not a lot of these were made. Why? Because they were pretty expensive when they were new. Uh, but they are the Commander. It's the big daddy. It's a 2007 model turbo diesel, three litre, seven seater, four wheel drive. Uh, in immaculate condition. It really has been well looked after. So come check it out. We'll start over here at the front. You see you got your fog lights, your indicators, got your big chrome grill there. No one's gonna mess with you. Got your parking sensors on the front. So before you do ram up someone's bum, you're certainly gonna know about it. But hey, if they deserve it, they deserve it. You are the commander. Remember that, all right? Don't take any shit while you drive this car. So, good tyres on it. I see no scratches on the alloys at all. Plenty of tread. These tough looking guards over here with the bolt screw things on the outside. Yeah, that'll Looks look. Looks that on it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Roof racks got the chrome strip. The commander, all right, once again, in case people forget. Don't forget it. All right, come along. Here's the other tire, have a quick look. Plenty of good tread, good condition. Here's the fuel cap. That's where you put the fuel, all right, in there. This is not only just the commander, but it is the limited, okay, which means you have to pay me more money for it because it's limited, all right? Not many of them. But uh, it does mean that you get tons of extras as well, like this beautiful chrome color coded. Oh, wow. Hold on while they're getting dragged behind, I guess. <laughs> you know? um, who knows? You work it out, you do something with it. Let me pop that open for you. Plenty of boot space, okay, if you need a five seater, but. If you keep on breeding, all right, keep on having chillings. You pull these bad boys up, have a couple more babies, no stress, all right, you'll be able to fit them in. Put them back down again, you do that, just clip on the side there. As you can see on the side here, Brian, come around the side. You've got your power, another power source here. Air conditioning vents for the kids, cup holders, little stuff there so they can put all their crap in it, toys and books and what have you, more storage. If anything like my kids will just make a mess of it. Over this side, guys, you've got here adjustable air conditioning controls up here once again. Up there, all right, so you can adjust the fan, the temperature, and uh, which kid's going to get it, which one's not. All right, who's been naughty? Who hasn't? It does come with a hose bar, doesn't have a ball, however, I may be able to steal one out of another car for you. It's got a three and a half ton towing capacity as well guys, so plenty of power. Come on around, nice dark tinted windows as you can see, because the commander needs his privacy. Alright, good tyres, more good alloy, good alloy. Quickly show on that tyre there. Alright, have a look inside this thing. It is lovely. First of all, you've got electric seats, leather trim all throughout, all in good condition. The hood lining hasn't got a mark on it. Been very, very well looked after. Where are you looking at now? The back seats? Just everywhere. Just everywhere all over? Just all over. It's all pretty. It is pretty. She's lovely. So, as you can see here, lovely wood grain finish on, on the dash, okay? Makes you look like you've got heaps of money and you're filthy rich even if you're not. All right. Uh, we've got touch screen sat nav aftermarket, but it does work. Let me go down here. So, steering wheel controls, you've got your... Uh, your um what's it called cruise control, cruise control on the right uh, and on the left it's done 225,000 kilometers has got a great service history it's got multiple airbags all around it 
So you're going to be safe. Stereo um, controls at the rear. What's that? Stereo, stereo controls at the rear, is it? Yes. Oh, it is too. Look at that. Stereo controls at the rear. Has got electric brakes as well. Over the side here, you can see, once again, nice wood grain finish, automatic seat memory, chrome door handles. Look at that. I'll pop the bonnet for you. Mind if I took it around? As a matter of fact, I'll, I'll, pop, the, I'll pop the bonnet for you because ah. it's on the left hand side. It's really very easy to operate an open. <laughs> if you're not half the time like me. Oh here. There it is, just there. Sorry, my fat fingers go missing up. So it's a three litre turbo diesel. It is a six cylinder. Yes. Um, plenty of power. Pretty good fuel economy as well. I Been well serviced, well looked after, there's no oil leaks, no rattles, or anything like that. We get an average of 10.8 litres per 100 kilometres uh, and an 80 litre tank, so plenty of fuel for those long trips. So, you know, you stand out from the crowd. It's not just a uh, normal looking Jeep. These were about 15 grand more than the Grand Cherokee when they came out. And um, it's an awesome truck. It's comfortable, it's luxurious, it's tough as shit. Look at it. So um, if you like it, if you want to have a look, if you want any more info, you can apply for finance. If you want to have a chat, uh, you know how to get a hold of us. Thanks for watching guys.